Well, Catherine, we're here at the Athens Airport and we're ready to take off for where? <laughs> Going to Milan. And we're about to board a bus before we get onto our plane. It's a nice warm day. Aegean Airlines. As we say goodbye to Greece, we are headed now to Milan. It is June 15th, 2015, and here we are at Rainy Lucerne, and we're about to get on uh, an explosion, right? Tell us. To something called Jungfrau Yacht, which is at uh, the top of Europe, some small, tall mountain on the top of the Alps. This is our tour guide, and we will be headed to Snow Country very shortly. What's down here? In the valley, of course, it sounds with the echo like four of them, but it's maybe just two of the planes. That's one of the bases down here, still active. Nowadays, it's not as easy as in medieval times anymore. And to the left now, we have a look down the top right here. Here we are on the train. First of two And he's giving us some history here. It's amazing how much he looks like Inspector Cousteau. <laughs> Just put a hat on him. Have you ever been told you look like Peter Sellers? <laughs> It is a little chilly here today. Here we go. There it is. Wow. All right, here we are, 11,333 feet. Honey, here we are. We're going into the top of Europe. Yes, and here is the man who actually built this railway. Seller. They thought he was crazy to build this railway. Built it and we are able to experience it. We're going to go see the top of Pretty cool. And we're here. Oh. <laughs> Not only are we on top of the world, but I think the whole world is here represented. <laughs> it is foggy today on top of the uh, top of Europe. Uh, it's snowing. And it is snowing, isn't it? Honey? It's it is snowing, snowing up here. And we can see snow. Ravens. You can see ravens. Nothing else. And here is what's called the Sphinx. The observation point, and this is at 11,333 feet. Here we are. Top of Europe. And then just to show you, we are on a platform. So right below us here, we're 11,330 feet high. You can see the raven below us. This is something to think that we were in the Mediterranean on a cruise just a few days ago. Yeah, in 80 degrees. All right, so here we are in the snow fun land. And maybe you can see the snow. It really is coming down now. Uh, we have just come down a few feet. The Sphinx is up there. The observation tower. And honey, the snow is really covering your hair now. Let it snow, let it snow, <laughs> let it snow. Here it is, mid-June. Wow, this is fabulous. It's a people mover right to the ice palace. That's where we're headed next. Pioneers, these old pictures of what they went through to dig these tunnels. Very, very slippery here. We're in the ice palace. 
which I'm gonna let you go first, Catherine, because it's gonna be very slippery. Woohoo! Ice. Ice. Ice, ice, baby. <laughs> Call it the Ice Palace. We're literally in little tunnels going through the Ice Palace. Yes. Uh -huh. Wow, honey, how about this? We're actually in like a little ice cave here in the Ice Palace. You can really tell it's snowing now. We're now at 11,401 feet. Is that right? Wow. And it's quite chilly here in the snow. Here we are. We're not alone. We're not alone. This is great. Still celebrating our anniversary. Typically, it would be nice and warm, which we were doing just a week ago. But now, here it is, cold. I wonder what the tip is, Kathy. It's cold. It's cold, and it's. it's do you want a snowball, Joey? Uh -huh. June 14th. It's June 16th, 2015. We're back over in Switzerland now. We've been going back and forth on the Italian border, the Swiss border, and we're headed back toward Lake Como. But this is just the lake region, and it's a beautiful day. Once again, we're really enjoying this vacation. Beautiful part of the world with all the mountains. Part of it remind us of North Carolina and then coming down into the lake. All the flowers are in bloom here too. Looks like we're moving back into more rain there. Yes. Windy road, but just look at this. Oh yeah, you can really see the rain and the weather straight ahead. The beautiful castle on the hill. Wow. This is really something, isn't it? So it looks like this storm's moving in, but Catherine, look at that over there. It looks like a, what'd you say, a curtain? A curtain of rain, and it's between the two mountains. The name of this lake is... Lugano. Lugano. And we're in Switzerland, correct? Or Italy. Or Italy. We, we've just been hugging the border all along, but look at that. How about that castle? really is. Look at that. That is really something. It's raining over there and as you can see it's not raining here on us just yet but we're about to move into it. Honey, here it is. June 16th. We have checked into the Palace Hotel. This is our room for the night it's very nice ceiling is quite high bathroom is right through here you just saw the beautiful cathedral shower we're having cocktails yes we are <laughs> a lovely glass, glass of wine she says <laughs> we've had a big day today it is june 17th 2015 and here we are Lake Como, we're taking a cruise ride. 
Here we are, Catherine. So, we first want to wish the twins a happy 17th birthday. Happy, happy birthday from Lake Como, Italy. We're thinking of you today and we love you very much. We are having a fabulous vacation. And uh, now Aunt Catherine is looking for George Clooney because he lives over in this direction. So we'll see if we find him today. Our boat. We're gonna go catch it. Like I'm on top of the world here. This is unbelievable. This is above Lake Como.